right guys, we are at the at home store and we are walking through the Christmas tree forest right now. But what we're here for today is to see all the awesome inflatables that they have for Christmas because they always have totally sweet ones. <laughs> this whole store is stocked with Christmas stuff. But yeah, I just have a little bit of time so I want to come in here and check out the inflatables. They have all these awesome ones over here. But we'll start with the little small ones here like Mr. Dinosaur. What the heck? Why do they have a Christmas Triceratops here? Then we have a Christmas baby polar bear here with a little cupcake. A small Christmas tree. We have a Christmas penguin. We have a Christmas snowman. Oh, look at this. We even have a three and a half foot Christmas unicorn right here. We have a Santa back here. We have the gingerbread man. A little three and a half foot angel. And then we have another Santa over here and a very small elf. And of course we have some of these giant like plastic um, ornaments I guess they are there's some red and green ones over here that you can see those aren't really inflatable I mean you blow them up but they're not inflatable like these guys are this is all the stuff that we really want to see though throughout this area here so let's go ahead and start right here with the naughty nice Kevin Minion. Look, he even has his name crossed out and an arrow pointing from the naughty to the nice list. And then we have a little Harry Potter. This thing is actually pretty cool. He's only three feet tall, but he is pretty awesome. We have the camping snowman with his fire here. This fire looks pretty dang cool. I like that. And he's actually roasting a marshmallow over the fire. Oh wait, this reindeer is actually part of it too. You get the reindeer, the snowman, and the fire, and they're both roasting marshmallows. Here's a whole bunch of boxes of inflatables we'll look at in a minute, but I just want to keep looking at the ones that are already inflated here. We had this four-foot scout elf sitting on the uh, on the present he's almost like the elf on a shelf and wait a minute the more that i look at this one i realize there's even more to it this is a tent in the background so they are legit camping it's an inflatable tent with the snowman and the reindeer and the campfire all right let's just move around this way here we have a six foot inflatable bear with a giant present Ooh, look and he has the uh the buffalo plaid um, hat and scarf on, that's cool. We have a little Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer here, and if you look very close, you can see that his nose is actually lit up and blinking. Oh, hello, sir. Why are you sitting amongst the inflatables? Okay, if you look right back here, we have an igloo with a penguin, and watch the penguin. He goes in and out of the igloo. All right, come on, you can go back down now. Come on now, we're waiting. Here he goes, he's slowly going back down into the inflatable. And if we hang out here for a minute, we'll be able to see him pop right back out the top. Okay, keep watching, here he comes. You can see his hat coming out first. <laughs> it's hilarious. He just pops right out the top of the igloo. Not to mention this ginormous, happy Christmas dog right here. Wait a minute. Is it a dog? I think it's a dog with reindeer ears on. I don't think it's a reindeer. I think it's legit a dog. Yeah, okay, hold on. See, even his tag right there says, six foot Christmas dog with moose antlers and light string. I knew it wasn't a reindeer. Then we got this little penguin friend here. It's called the six foot penguin mailbox scene. He's sitting on a present and, oh, he's holding the label for the box that says care of North Pole. Oh, wait a minute, there's actually more to it. So you get that one over there. He's behind this pole, so we can't see it. You got this guy here that says, dear, dear Mr. Claus. And then they have a letters for Santa. Oh, there's another one on top. Okay, so that is a giant mailbox there that says letters for Santa. And each of them are getting ready to mail letters to Santa, including the one that's on top. Then we have the seven foot Santa back here. We have a five foot Santa and friends. There's Santa and the friends would be the dog there and the Christmas tree. Hmm, oh wait, there's more. 
there's a present, and there's a snowman here. I was gonna say, I've never considered a tree a friend, but I will from now on. I'm sorry, tree friend. I hope I didn't hurt your feelings. Okay, back in here we can see the shivering snowman guy. We're gonna work our way around and hopefully get a good look at him. But look at this awesome Christmas tree truck right here. Santa's tree delivery. You got Santa poking his head out the front window, or the side window, and you get the little like silver reindeer emblem on the front and then as we come along you can see we have an awesome christmas tree right there and then two jolly reindeer on top of the christmas tree all right i'm trying to get a good shot of the shivering uh snowman here i gotta move the minion for you to see him he's not shivering constantly but if you keep an eye on him you'll be able to see come on now yeah, he's like way back in there. Wait a minute, no, I'm looking at the wrong thing. We got a snowman here who's kind of scared with his uh, carrot nose. But that's not the one that I saw that was shivering. It's this guy back here whose shirt says brain freeze. And it's another snowman and he has an ice cream cone and he is shivering because he's so cold. Okay, so we've seen all of these. We're gonna go down and take a look at the giant ones down here. But first I wanna come over here and look at the ones that are in the boxes. There's this whole display here. And then there's another one over here with a bunch of smaller ones. So let's start with this one right here. It's a snowman pajama family and they're wearing the buffalo plaid pajamas. That's pretty cool. That is six and a half feet tall. And then under that we have a giant 20 and a half foot tall snowman family here. Here's the 20 foot Santa that I actually bought last year and I'll be inflating him in my front yard very soon. We have the six foot light up the holidays scout elf snow globe here. That's pretty cool. I think those lights in there like twinkle so that it looks like it's actually snowing in a snow globe. Okay, I'm gonna come over here real quick and look at these because it looks like they're starting to move these to a different area and I don't wanna miss any of them. So we just have like these really small ones up here. They're like three, three and a half feet. And we have the typical Santa here. We got a snowman, we have the bear, we have the gingerbread man, the elf. He's called a cheery elf. We have the little um, tree here. We have a little angel. Um, let's see, angel, tree, elf. Here's our little polar bear. Here's the little penguin. And then here's our tr Christmas triceratops. Up on top, I believe that's everything that we just looked at on these two rows. The camping inflatable we were looking at over there was just here, but the girl gathered them all up to take them to a different area. So we have the five and a half foot snowman and a dog right here. That's the one that we were trying to see, but we can't see it behind the others. We got the giant Christmas bear here. We saw that one inflated. The scout elf, we saw that one inflated. We got Santa. We have the uh, flashing nose. Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer, um, Kevin the Minion. Ooh, here's a Grinch. He is four feet tall. We have an awesome white inflatable Christmas tree here. I don't think I've seen one of those before. Let's see, we have Santa Claus and Friends right here. Um, Harry Potter, we got the penguin in the igloo over here. And here is the shivering snowman we were looking at with the brain freeze sweater. And then here is the penguin mailbox scene that we were looking at with the three penguins on the letters for Santa mailbox. Okay, so we got all those. She's getting ready to move those. Let's continue over here. We have a Christmas helicopter. This is cool. I hope they have one of these set up. We got Santa and two penguins here on a Christmas helicopter. And apparently, the blades actually spin. Santa in a chimney, and this is probably, does he go up and down? Maybe not, I thought he was kind of like the, uh, the penguin in the igloo where he'd go in and out of the chimney, but I guess not. Oh, here's another one though, and this one does go in and out of the chimney. This one's five feet tall, and this one is 11 and a half. We got the eight foot Santa sleigh ride up here on the top. Santa's sleigh with reindeer globe. And I think that's the same thing where it sparkles inside there to look like snow. We saw this one. Here's a nativity scene here. Hello, baby Jesus. Um, there's the giant Santa. We saw this one. Look at this. On the bottom, we have a 20-foot reindeer. That thing 
is huge. I, sh I should get that to accompany my 20-foot Santa. The only problem with those huge ones is like last year with my Santa, within the first day he tore because the wind was blowing, so I had to repair him with like duct tape. I mean, 200 bucks is a big investment for something that's gonna tear just because the wind blows. We got a 20-foot snowman down here on the bottom, and then over here we have a Happy Holidays 11-foot uh, what the heck do you call that? An archway, a grand candy cane archway tunnel. And that is what you can see right over here. Check it out. This thing is huge and totally awesome. The grand candy cane inflatable archway tunnel. We got Santa on top. It says happy holidays. Look at this. You can hear all the inflatables here with all the wind blowing. Um, let's see. We have one, two, it looks like three spirals of candy cane making up the tunnel and of course we have mr elf in his snow globe and just like i said you can see how the lights are sparkling to make it look like it's actually a snow globe and it's snowing in there but yeah we are inside the candy cane tunnel right now this is pretty dang cool. $299.99 for that. And I have to stand so far back just so you can see the whole thing in the picture because it's so huge. And then we have the five and a half foot Santa here on the end that goes in and out of the chimney. And it's funny because right beside him is the 11 and a half foot Santa that's in the chimney, but he does not go in and out. He's pretty cool because he's absolutely enormous, but I do like this one over here, how he goes in and out of the chimney. Oh look, it's a regular chimney. Wait a minute, what's this that I see? It's Santa. <laughs> All right, let's keep on moving back here. Here's the white inflatable Christmas tree that I hadn't seen. I don't think I've ever seen a white inflatable Christmas tree before, but these are like pastel ornaments on here, green and purple and pink. It looks pretty cool though, I like it. All right, so let's see, we have the eight foot Santa sleigh ride inflatable beside that. I really like that one, look at this. We got Santa in the front, and then we got a reindeer here who's kind of scared, and then we have Mr. Snowman in the back who's having a jolly old time. I should totally build a sled like that that looks like Santa's sleigh that we can actually take to a big hill and go sledding down the hill. Here's a couple of those blow up ornaments I was talking about. These you can actually see through though. We got red and green. I didn't see those on the shelf back there though. I wonder how much they are. Oh well, behind them we have the whole six and a half foot snowman pajama family wearing the plaid shirts that is so cool i love that Ooh, 50 percent off all halloween pillows oh well that's not what we're here to see right now we're here to see the six foot santa sleigh with reindeer inside a snow globe this is so cool look at this we got the reindeer on the front and he's a jolly soul and then we have santa in his sleigh back here inside the snow globe and just like the other one the lights are blinking inside there to make it look like an actual snow globe like it's snowing that is very cool i really like that one all right let's keep on moving we got the nativity scene over here hello baby jesus and then we have this giant grinch over here holy crap i don't think i saw him in a box I wonder if he's sold out already. He's got the big stocking over here that says nice. Hello, Grinch. <laughs> of course, then we have a big inflatable Christmas tree beside him. And then we have, oh, it's another 11 and a half foot Santa in a chimney over here. And unless there's another display somewhere, I believe that is all. But these are all totally awesome. Oh wait, here's our inflatable ornaments, the ones that you actually just blow up. Four foot ornament, there's a red one, a green one, there's a white one. Uh, let's see, we got some two and a half foot ones. Looks like that's all the colors, white, red, and green. And these are $12.99 each. Oh, and I was just about to leave and I found this inflatable igloo that I hadn't seen. It's in a completely different area in the store. Five foot LED igloo with a star. That's pretty cool. And these blow up light bulbs that I hadn't seen before. These are 3.3 feet tall and there's a couple of them blown up right there. Yeah. 